Today we are back in solo queue. And have you noticed in your inbox that there's actually a buff for the revamped Vexana? So it looks like Moonton is paying attention to the cries of all the Vexana mains. But of course, reading a patch note is not enough. I mean, they could write up random stuff and say that she's buffed, but I gotta find out for myself. And by the way, I think we have a fashion show going right here with slot 4. Which hero are you really gonna use? And it looks like after showing all of his skins, he has finally decided to go with Johnson. This is actually gonna work for us real good because Johnson and Vexana seem to be able to compete with the Johnson and Odette combo and it's very effective. So let's go Joksana. And now that we are in the game, of course, we're going to head over to the mid lane. But before that, let's get our first uh, item, our favorite item to buy first for mages, which is Elegant Gem. I mean, just look at us. I mean, we're elegant. It, there's no reason why we shouldn't buy that gem. And also, shut up, Valier. I'm not gonna catch your silly fireballs. But it looks like you've emptied both of your balls. I mean, you used up all your skills without hitting me, so it didn't reset. That only means I can be confident that I cannot clear you because I can make your minions explode. So far, so good. We don't have any problems here with Fireboy and almost got that Karina. And we can just delete his minions just like that. But it looks like we have a little problem here. Our tank is getting caught by Valir's flaming hot balls. And I really don't want to get in between them because I might die instead. They are rest in peace, Mr. Transformer. We'll, we'll get them later. Meanwhile, I'm just gonna keep doing my job here in the mid lane and clear the enemy minion wave almost instantly. So we can head to the bot lane and help out our teammates in maybe securing some kills. There we go, very nice. You can try to outclear me, Mr. Fireboy. Yes, you can, but if your minions are prone to explosions just like that, then you may have a problem of getting stuck here defending against my minions as I go to the bottom lane. Oh, it looks like this time I don't need to walk all the way to the bot lane because Johnson is nice enough to deliver me as a package to these enemies that did not order anything. And it looks like this has turned into a really big and dangerous teamfight, so let's stay back for a while. Because I, I don't want to be in the middle of the teamfight, I just want to watch from 10 miles away. But I see a Karina on that other bush and I can smell her killer intent from right over here, so why don't you just kill yourself? Meanwhile, we got our jungler Julian already behind Estes. What a splendid work of waiting the last minute and uh, not helping us out when we were in trouble earlier. Okay, this is probably the only reason why people play Vexana. It's to uh, get this kind of satisfaction that no other hero can give. Um, guys, I really don't have mana and I'm having a lot of fun blowing up minions. But of course, I'll be right there if you need me. I am your teammate after all, your teammate which only has mana for one skill. So we better use it up to delay this Valier. So that our jungler can escape that teamfight without any problem. But you already took Valier's balls. Ooh, nice. You still killed him though. Unfortunately, that Estes that finished you off is gonna get away. I told you I didn't have mana. Guys, isn't it about time for me to get some kills going on right here? Can you uh, take me somewhere where we can secure some of our kills, Mr. Johnson? Oh, but actually, we don't have to because this Valier took the time and effort to let me secure our kill. And now we're going to exit that fight elegantly with uh, Johnson. I really look good on top of Johnson, don't I? Where are we going though? I mean the turtle is up so yep the enemies are around here somewhere. I'm just gonna have to trust this Johnson to land at the right spot and that is definitely the best spot possible. Now I know why Odette loves riding Johnson. He knows how to hit the right spots with his uh, ultimate. Hey don't you die to that turtle Mr. Julian that will be so embarrassing. Too bad it didn't happen. Hey, going somewhere, big boy? Hopefully not too far because Valir is here and with a simple combo, he's uh, already dead again. I told you the Joksana combo is really good. 
Wait, enemy triple kill? What, what have you guys been doing? You've been diving towers? Is that it? And this ultimate of mine is still as lazy AF, but it attacks faster now. That's what's good about it, I guess. But now that it's gone, I think it's time for us to get the heck out of here because this Karina thinks she can kill me. Well, I have the power of skipping ahead in time where I am not dead and I am alive and I totally escaped that and you believe me. And that is the power of video editing, but no editing could help us secure that lord. So let's just murder all the enemies who are still here, especially this Karina who suddenly thinks she could 1v5. She's probably gonna edit that footage as well on her her end. Maybe give herself a little uh, maniac or savage right there. Understandable. But now that all the enemies are dead and I still have this uh, big simp ultimate that's destroying the enemy tower, I think it's safe to say that we got this game in the bag. So I'm just gonna stand right here and stop that Valier from even trying. I mean, I'm burning but this is okay. Can you guys finish the game now? Oh crap, this is uh, so not good. Did we run out of minions? Yeah, we couldn't finish the game totally because we ran out of minions and not because I was just standing there and not hitting the base, right? See, even Julian knows what happened, so it's totally not my fault. Could someone enlighten me how we got into this situation? We lost two towers and now the enemies are uh, in position to take the next lord. What happened? Just a few seconds ago, I was trying to take a victory selfie in front of the enemy's exploding base and now I'm uh, in front of Karina trying to destroy her face. If only she wasn't doing the Lord, she wouldn't have died in disgrace. But it looks like the enemy fireboy in killing the Lord, he took her place. Why are we rhyming though? It's not like this Estes is here to say hello. In fact, with immortality, he can still go for round 2 but his second life he's about to throw. Okay, I think I'm done rhyming because we got two enemies that needs killing. Okay, that was too close. That Belleric was too low. If only we had one more teammate that could help us finish off our enemies. Too bad we don't guys, too bad we don't. But at least he's finishing the game now for us, right? Securing the victory. I mean, he's not in the team fight, so that's the least that he can do. Like uh, split push and finish the game. We are so fun. But that is fine. Let us not forget that we are currently using Vexana and nobody is better at clearing waves of minions better than her. But since the enemy has got no minions right now, I think we should just clear this wave of enemy heroes. Really guys, we lost all of our tower and our carry is on a suicidal mission. She thinks that she can 1 versus 1 Karina. This Karina's building full damage, isn't she? She's dealing a lot of damage. So let's just stay back and snipe at the enemies with our skill too. Ooh, that's pretty close. But we're not gonna chase them, of course. We're gonna focus on clearing the minions who are trying to destroy our base and our future for a victory selfie. But I look really cool riding on top of this uh, Optimum Pride, so um... Yep, we're uh, gonna go with this plan because this plan seems really good because if we can kill this Moskov then I think it's gonna be worth it because Moskov is the enemy's uh, best damage dealer and the best chance of uh, ending the game. We did our part. But that wasn't enough because the enemies are back inside our base trying to end the game. Luckily we only have 5 seconds left before we resurrect. And we are back to playing tower defense and I think the enemies are trying to do the lord but it's too risky to go there Johnson. Just um, focus on killing these enemies right in front of us. If we can just uh, take down some of them then it'll be easy to get rid of all of them. And it looks like it's working because their tank is dead, their jungler is dead and this Moskov almost uh, got lucky. But you know what they say, right? Almost is never enough. Just like with this Valier, he almost escaped. Almost. Wait a minute. We, did we really wipe them out? This might be it, guys. This might be it. Just push that lane. I'm gonna head over to the mid lane. But I forgot that they got the Lord and it's smacking me real hard. I'm pretty low on HP. Let's uh, stay back for a bit because I can't really go back home. I need to help our jungler in clearing the minion waves so we can end up here right in front of the enemy base and um, the enemies are now alive right yep it's time to get out of here 
and hopefully my teammates can stay alive because I'm about to go home and Johnson is waiting for me that's great we can do the joke sana combo again and this time we're gonna go nowhere what that is fine Johnson's probably tired of driving for 20 minutes straight because this game is, uh, has taken long enough and if we don't do anything soon, like uh, delete this Karina, then uh, our teammates might get tired and we might lose this battle. So let's take advantage of their jungler dead and see if we can take care of anyone else. Okay, let's be sneaky around here and put this uh, Belleric to rest. But they still have one more guy that we need to catch. Luckily, he wants to get caught because he walked right into my skill 1. And that is it, right? It's a wipeout. Come on guys, this is literally impossible to lose now. So I'm just going to stand right here and the minions are in my way. Okay, the game finished too fast, but I'm gonna have to take that victory selfie. It's not so bad. I have my ultimate up and I'm walking in style. So it's a nice victory selfie. And there you go. That is the Vexana, the new Vexana. Plus she got buffed and I think they listened to all the people who are crying about her revamp saying that she's too weak and they tweaked her numbers a little high this time. It feels like she's very strong. But yeah, I don't think we're gonna get that ultimate again like before where we can control the summon. That is fine, I guess. I mean, with her high damage right now and high crowd control, then I think she's in a good spot. Uh, she's playable. So again, my name is Shin Min Takazo, reminding you to stay safe, stay healthy, and always take care of yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hit like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more of these in the future. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.